Today I'm going to show you how to make this super pretty multicolored pastel leopard spots tumbler by using inks and glitter. Make sure you like and subscribe to my channel and look for all the discount codes and products used in the description. Let's get started. Today we are working on a 32 ounce plump from the Still Magnolia. I will have a discount code linked for you guys down in the description. We have sanded and painted our tumbler white and let that dry. And then we are going to apply our glitter using the epoxy method. So I have mixed up a little bit of epoxy. A little bit goes a long way on this method. Just make sure it's completely sticky where you are really pushing your hand and moving that epoxy around you should not have a heavy layer here and then we are going to take this absolutely stunning white glitter called angel wings and completely coat our cup Now you are going to let that glitter and epoxy layer cure and then we are going to move on to our inks. Today I am using Mimosa, Sour Apple Schnapps, Caribbean Storm, and Love Potion. These are all from Woody's Goodies and I have put them all in their own separate medicine cups. And then you are gonna grab four very small paintbrushes, one for each color. And then we are going to just dab a little bit in one of the colors. I did these where they would kind of melt together in a beautiful manner. So I did the green and yellow and then the pink and like purple. And you're just going to dab a little bit of the yellow on first and then dab around the yellow with the green. Then we are going to take our purple and a little bit of these inks go a long way. This is why we're using a brush and not just dripping them on. And then going back in with the pink and just having them blend super beautifully and keep on alternating the green and yellow and pink and purple until you get all of your spots on. Once all of your spots are on, let that ink completely dry and then add a layer of epoxy. Now that your epoxy layer has cured, we are going to add the black around our leopard spots. I have mixed up some glitter glue and some chalk paint that is black. You can use acrylic paint as well. I just have this little brush and I like to make my spots with more of a dabbing motion instead of a brush stroke motion. And then I'm just going to kind of dab it imperfectly on there and then take our black glitter called formal and sprinkle that on while that glitter glue and paint mixture is still wet. Thank you. 
continue doing this step until all of your spots have all the black around them. Once that glitter glue and paint layer has dried, it doesn't take long whatsoever. The bottom was dry by the time I finished the top, so maybe five to 10 minutes. You're going to take a dry brush and just brush away the excess on your tumbler. And then we are gonna go back in with our black paint and glue mixture and we're just going to add little dots in between. I kind of like to add kind of half little moon shapes or C shapes and fill in all of those gaps. Then once again, when that glitter glue has dried, you're going to take your dry brush one more time and brush off that excess black glitter. Make sure this is completely dry and then you are going to take it and spray seal it really well. I like to do two to three semi-heavy coats of Krylon or Rust-Oleum's Triple Thick and then we are going to let that dry completely. Now that your spray sealer is all dry, add a layer of epoxy. Once that epoxy layer has cured, you can add a decal. I chose this one that says perfectly imperfect and I layered white on top of this pastel ombre vinyl from Tech Wrap Craft and I am applying it going vertically up the tumbler. Now add your final layers of epoxy until your cup is completely smooth and then your beautiful work of art is completely finished. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please remember to like and subscribe.